Hello and welcome to our YouTube channel where we discuss all things audio. I'm here with Kent Larson, the audio expert. Oh. The king. <laughs> <laughs> the king of audio and he's going to answer all your questions. Now I have a few for him to begin with, but after the video, if you want to know something, leave a comment below and we'll do our best to address it here. That's the, the right term. the show. The best <laughs> of what we got. <laughs> okay, so subwoofer. That's our topic for today. Um, you probably heard it all your life and you may even know what it is, but I don't know what it is. So my question for you, Kent, is what is a subwoofer? Yes, all about the bass. So the subwoofer is a speaker. But it's a speaker that only plays the deep sounds. Uh, so only like okay. the very deep sounds. And so to assist that part of the music or a movie or yeah, to give that experience of, you know, if there's not bass enough in your speakers, you're gonna need a subwoofer. Okay. Yeah. So do you always pair the subwoofer with um, like two speakers uh -huh. yeah. and it, it can never go on its own then I'm assuming. That would be a weird person if they only want to hear that deep, deep, deep sounds. But okay. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know. So it always has to go with the speakers. Yeah, I mean, yeah, because it, it doesn't play like the voices or lead instruments or, you know, all the, you know, the, the parts of the, you know, of the actual melody and all that. Yeah. It is only like the really, really, really d deep sounds like the stuff that, that you know, hammers, barely hammers in your chest. It's more like the, the thing that's rumbling in the room, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, that's what the subwoofer is. And the very low, deep bass. Yes, yes. Okay. Uh, yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And, and so there's a lot of interesting things connected to the subwoofer that applies to the subwoofer that doesn't really apply to the speaker so much, you know, because it has its domain own down thing. there. It's yeah. its own thing. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, so. One question that I have is, um, what is the difference between subwoofer and woofer? Because yeah. I hear both of those terms, uh -huh. and I'm like, which is which? What are we right. talking about? Or are they the same thing? Yeah. I mean, it, they're the same built. I mean, if you talk about the raw driver, you know, the raw driver is this. Because you will also call a subwoofer like the whole thing, you know, the box and the speaker driver and everything. Okay. But but for people that built their own speakers, they also there's also a terminology called a subwoofer for that. That, for, you know, where you're talking about the actual speaker driver. Just the driver. Yeah, but so but they both have the same thing in common. If it's a full like finished product or it's just a raw driver like this, just the, the thing that moves the air. Well, they both are focused on from like 150 hertz and down, or like the only the deep mm -hmm. sounds where a woofer will have the ability to play uh, higher tones, like uh, be more a part of the music, if you like. I mean, the well, it's, does. yeah, I mean, like more a part of the actual melody, you know, oh, and play okay. higher tones, like so you can start to hear more of the voices through it. Uh -huh. um, and how the, the difference uh, is not clearly defined, technically. There's no clear like definition of okay. these two. Yeah. Subwoofer it just kind of means that it is the, vo the the tones that leans towards the subsonic uh, frequency. Subsonic means that it's beneath our hearing, like it's under 20 hertz. So down towards that is subsonic. And you know, f for another video, you will have ultrasonic, which is past uh, our hearing upwards, like in the high tones. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so on that's that note, yep, yeah. I hope you have figured out what a subwoofer is. I hope we cleared that up. Boom! <laughs> and we'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye! Bye-bye.